You know, guys, for whatever reason, we weren't going to do it, but we're going to do it. Caleb here, thank you so much for dropping in on the channel and checking out whatever goes on on here. We don't even know, but thank you so much. I truly appreciate it. Falling in Reverse, the infamous legendary Falling in Reverse, the infamous, the legendary Ronnie Radke dropped a new music video for Voices in My Head. I was out of town. I was doing stuff. I thought, you know, the ship had sailed. I was not going to do a reaction for this, but of course... Apparently, this is a song and a video worth reacting to, per usual, and it's number nine on trending. I think this was like number three or four on trending on music, which is just absolutely incredible and huge kudos to them. But, you know, some things we just can't get away from. So we're going to hit this thing. No other intro. This is Falling in Reverse, Voices in My Head. I'm kind of pumped, actually. You know, these guys have consistently made absolute bangers. You guys cannot deny hate or love Ronnie Radke. You know, I don't know why you guys hate him. I, I think he's really chill. You know, I think he's very respectable. He's done some stupid crap. So, so has everybody else. So, you know, I don't know what the big deal is. We're going to hit this in three, two, one, go. The voices in my head keep on telling me to pray because I'm spinning like a carousel circle in the train. Hit the bottom of the bottle. I, don't I mean, his mind pain, but that for is music creation is really good. I don't want to talk about the voices in my head keep on begging me to stay. If I pull the trigger now, then the demons go away. Okay. And I know my time is coming, so there ain't no time to waste. So that is all I got for now. I don't want to talk about the voices in my head keep telling me to choose a side. <laughs> That's some escape the fate, hell, Ronnie, right there. I'm a sad boy, you know better. Please don't make this last forever. The voices in my head oh. keep telling oh. me I'm not okay. It's feeling like a hurricane in my brain. Dude. This style is really working for them, chorus. Die. Too easy. <laughs> oh yeah, Ronnie's like on TikTok now. Oh, this transition is is fire, dude. Whenever bands do that tr transition halfway through the verse, you can't go wrong. They go back to the chorus. I love that. Oh my gosh. Sort of a gimmicky chorus, but I cannot deny that it is stupid catchy. We got some kind of bridge. Is it gonna slap? Traditionally, yes. First things first, I'm gonna take the world with me when they put me in the dirt. We got the build up halfway through. You know, following the formula. Right. This is a this is a nice transition back into the chorus at the end. Jeez, man, it's been out for a week. It's 2.5 million views. You say what you want, man. The numbers don't lie. Oh shoot, is that Luke? Is Luke Hall in their drummer now? That was like the first time they even showed the drummer, and that was totally Luke Hall. Recognize that guy. Dang it. That was it? I could have done that for like another minute or so. All right, you guys, falling in reverse, voices in my head. What do we think? You know, it is a very structural formula, formatted song, and I say, and I'm a huge advocate of that on this channel. I think that the verse, chorus, verse, chorus, bridge, slow chorus, fast chorus, it's a working formula, and you know what? You can be the band who wants to stand out and just do like a verse, 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 breakdown, breakdown, verse. You're fine, do what you want, but the numbers don't lie here, you guys. Falling in reverse, it doesn't matter. They've kind of like developed this, you know, rap, metalcore hybrid, and I think it really works for this band. And I think what they're doing sounds really good. Personally, I thought the chorus was a little bit gimmicky with the ah, yeah, yeah's, but it was 
super catchy, super catchy. And the, it's, a, it's an insane hook. You've got the forever that he kind of sings really high. Catchy. It's a hook. Ronnie Radke is so smart. This band is just stupid smart. Now the breakdown, sure, you know, at this point, it, it's kind of whatever. We've all heard that breakdown before. It wasn't anything new, but it is nice and it's well placed in the song. You know, you got to have some kind of bridge with like a slow bridge that went into like a... I don't know, orchestra, chorus sounded, or whatever sound good, maybe, but the breakdown, the heaviness of it sounded good. It really wrapped the song up. Then you've got the break into the half chorus, fast chorus, which I thought sounded really good. Nothing else to say, you guys. I mean, this isn't like the best song I've ever heard in my life, but it is a good song. It's a terrific song. It's executed very well, falling in reverse. They know what they're doing, you guys. They absolutely know what they're doing. Let me know what you guys think. Make sure you recommend something down in the comments. Thank you so much for dropping in. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and we'll catch you on the next video.